Hey kids, welcome to night three of Vacation Bible School. We're gonna have so much fun today. Today I wanna to tell you a story that takes place at the very beginning of the New Testament. So for years and years and years, people had been waiting for the Messiah or the promised one to come to the earth. There had been prophets that had come and saying that, that there was gonna be someone that was gonna come and save the world. And people had been waiting for this forever and ever and ever. And finally, it happened. An angel came to a girl named Mary and told her that she was going to have a son. You'll have a son, and his name will be Jesus. Wow. Then the angel went and told Joseph also. You'll have a son, and his name will be Jesus. So Mary and Joseph went to go find a place to have the baby and they were trying to go to every place and they kept getting turned down no 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 sorry <laughs> so finally they stumbled upon a man who owned a hotel but he didn't have any rooms available. He only had a stable out back. And so that's where Mary and Joseph went to have the baby Jesus. So while this was going on, there were some wise men who were really, really smart, who knew that a Messiah was going to come. They found out, and so they went to go meet this baby that had been born. What did the prophet Isaiah mean by the coming Messiah? Jesus was born, he is king of the Jews. They saw a star, and they followed the star, and that's how they found where the baby was born. And while they were going, they passed King Herod and told him what they were doing. But King Herod didn't like it because he was afraid that this new baby would grow up to be king and overthrow him. What are you doing here? We're going to see Jesus, King of the Jews. <laughs> Once the wise men arrived, they brought Jesus gifts. We have brought you gifts, frankincense, myrrh, go. And there was also shepherds who were living out in the fields, keeping watch over their sheep. And there were some angels that came to them and told them that Jesus was going to be born. So the baby was born and they called his name Jesus and he was going to be the savior of the world. This is what we celebrate at Christmas time. This is why we celebrate Christmas. And I know it doesn't feel like Christmas outside right now. It's really, really hot outside. But it's important because we should celebrate Jesus' birth all year long. So today, this is what you're going to talk about in your classes. Hope you have a great time at Vacation Bible School today.